hello hello and welcome back to the channel today I'm going to show you what to do with your smaller berries that you don't use so here I am just going to make a label because I am going to be coating them in fruity pebbles so here I just pulled up a logo on my Cricut I'm going to size it down to 2.0 by 2.0 And as you can see, I have my arrow here and I'm going to the top to size it. And once we size this down, we are going to put it in a circle and we are going to print it out. So here I'm just playing around with my Cricut to see which logo I like best. And I did not choose this one, I chose a solid background. I didn't really like this one because of the bold outing. And the inside I didn't like too much, so I went with a different one. But I wanted to see which one looked best. So I played around with it a little and I did come up with a decision. Okay, so I'm just gonna duplicate my image so I have more than one on one sheet. Okay guys, so this is how it should look once it's on your mat. If it doesn't look like this, it's incorrect. And I'm just going to go over and press send and it's going to go to my printer. Okay, so I did not like my image. It was way too big for my box. So I just cut the wording out and I'm just taking off the backing and I'm going to place it on our box. Now let's get into these Fruity Pebble Berries. I am going to dip my first berry. I am going to shake and remove as much excess chocolate as possible and I'm going to be coating them with my Fruity Pebbles. Okay guys, so never get rid of your smaller berries. You can always use them. All you have to do is package them up in a smaller packaging. You can also cup them with lidded cups and sell them for half the price.
So we're gonna give our berries some extra chocolate and we're gonna package them up. Hope you guys enjoyed this idea. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And like always, thanks for watching.